This is Code.org. I'm currently working on CS Fundamentals. Challenge Puzzle. Challenge Puzzles are lessons designed to stretch your brain. Just do the best you can. Oh, I will. All right, so I'm ready. Challenge. Uh, ooh, Functions and Artists, Puzzle 10. Challenge. Create the image using the limited blocks provided. Oh, and only 14 of them. Each triangle has sides of 50, degree, uh, 50 pixels. To draw a diamond, you will need to alternate between turning 60 degrees and 120 degrees. Okay. So, hmm. Oh, yeah, this looks tricky. So we're going to want to draw functions to kind of limit how much code we actually have to, well, write. So what are the two shapes we're trying to make here? Hmm. Do we want to draw so it looks like we're going to draw triangles while doing each side of this diamond let's do the small shape first okay now like a square in order to draw each side, and each side's going to be the same length, we'll use a loop. But a square has four sides, triangles obviously have three. So repeat three times, uh, 50 pixels, okay. Move forward, and not 100, 50. Oh, wow, and that had a, does that, zero. So we're only supposed to use this once, yikes, and create all of this. All right. We're going to move forward 50, and then what? Uh, diamond alternate. So I think for the... Let's try 120. And then I'm going to just test this out. Draw a triangle. So when I hit run, draw a triangle, droop, and it runs that code, which draws each side. Okay, so that looks good. Measurements are good. All right. So that is drawing our triangle. Awesome. Now what? Well, we're going to want to move forward to draw the next one by 50. Hmm. So... Draw a triangle, actions, and it doesn't want us to use move forward. This is tricky. So, draw a triangle, and then what? We would want to... Oh, well, we don't... Can we... Ah, let's jump forward, and if the side is 50, but each side touches, right? Let me... Uh, jump forward by 100 and draw a triangle. Let's see. Yeah, so we're skipping. Okay, since each side touches, we'd only want to jump forward by 50. Perfect. And then, well, how many times are we going to want to do that? It looks like there's four triangles on a side. Hopefully we have another loop. Yeah, we can use a loop. All right, so now, instead of drawing a triangle, jump forward, draw a triangle, jump forward, we can just use a loop because we're repeating ourselves. So let's see. Oops. Let's test this out. Awesome. Okay. So what are we going to want to do after that? Well, we're going to want to turn... It looks like turn 60 degrees after we do all that stuff. So not 90, 60, so we can face this way. Yep. Okay. And then, well, then we're going to want to do this again once we turn. But then we're going to need to turn more than 60 here so it looks like this since this turn is going to be different each time we should make a function out of this because we're going to want to do that chunk of code more than once 
So it's good for a function, but we need to do different stuff in between each time we ask it to run. So let's say, I don't know, draw uh, diamond side maybe will be the name of my function for this. And draw diamond side is creating the side of the diamond by drawing the triangle four times and moving along. So once we do that, we're going to want to draw diamond side. Then we're going to turn. And what did I just have that I got rid of? I think turn right by 60. And then we're going to want to draw diamond side again. Let's try. Okay, and now this is going to be a different turn, right? So now we're going to turn right by, it looks like it would be, I don't know, like 120. Is that what they, oh, they gave it to us. Okay, and then function, draw diamond side. Ooh, we're at 14 blocks, though. Let's see what happens. Oh, and we only need one more side. So what would we do here? Oh, well now we're going to turn 60 and then we want to draw a side. Turn 60, draw a side. We can use a repeat. So let's go ahead and use a loop. And how many sides? We're going to draw four sides, right? So draw a side, turn right. Draw a side, zoop, turn right by 120, facing this way, zoop, zoop, and then do all that again on this side. And then, so how this code's going to run is we hit run, repeat two times, draw diamond side. Zoop, draw diamond side, the computer finds it here. Four times over, draw a triangle. So, oh, what's that? Oh, here it is. Okay, to draw a triangle, I'm going to, three times, I'm going to move forward by 50 and turn 120 degrees. Because, and then I hit the bottom and do it a second time, zoop, and a third time, and that will create the three sides of one of these small triangles. Then, zoop, I hit the bottom of this function, so I jump forward by 50 pixels. I would end up like here-ish. Hit the bottom of this, zoop, do it again. Draw another triangle four times, which draws the whole side of the diamond. Once I'm done with that, zoop, I hit the bottom of this. I turn 60 degrees, like here, and then draw this side again, zoop, run all that again. Then I turn 120, hit the bottom of this, and then do that again, drawing those two sides. Let's give it a shot. But da Oh, that is tricky. And we did it in 14 blocks. Awesome. Let's keep going.